It's another Purple Friday here, and the Ravens fans, they cannot wait for this next matchup. WJZ is live now in Elkridge. Max McGee shows us how fans are getting pumped for this weekend. Max, there you are. Yeah, here I am. Yeah, Denise, Rick, you know I love the party, especially on a Friday afternoon, and the Ravens are about to play the Browns. But right here in Elkridge, we're at Lido Pizza. We have all our friends here. We got the Ravens cheerleaders. We have everybody here. And we're about to have a big party here in Baltimore. Attention all shoppers inside Columbia Mall. There's a Raven spotting on the first floor. You got your chicken? It's week four's Raven Rally as the birds gear up for the Cleveland Browns at home. Fans are ready for a bounce back win versus a division rival. I'm, I'm Ravens all the way. It feels terrific out here. It feels like a winning championship coming along too. Along with the pregame excitement comes the necessary essentials for a big party. Annie Ann's pretzels, Chick-fil-A, Seasons 52, and many others fueling the rally. I couldn't believe it. I didn't know he was going to be here today. And when I saw all the people coming out, it was just so exciting. One of those people just happens to be former Ravens All-Pro running back Willis McGahee, who talked one-on-one -on -one with WJZ. As you look back on your career, what's probably the number one thing you're most proud of? The number one thing I'm most proud of is retiring as a Raven. Now, don't get me wrong, other teams, other cities are, are great, but it's like family here, and you can't find it everywhere else. Miguel, he says, even though he no longer plays in the NFL, coming back to Baltimore was an opportunity he'd run through any day. It's all about having fun, man, being, a, be able, to, being able to help out in the community, even if, even if I'm not playing. You know what I'm saying? They need me, I'm here. Back live here at Lido Pizza. On this event, was sponsored by M&T Bank and 98 Rock Baltimore. Now, you remember uh, McGahee playing for the Cleveland Browns in the last year of his career, so he's kind of partial. He doesn't want to give a prediction for the Ravens and Browns, but we will give the predictions coming up later in sports. We're live in Howard County tonight. Max McGee for WJC. Is a Raven. We all know what Willis is thinking. He doesn't have to say it. Max, thank you, man. Don't forget, you can see the Ravens battle the Browns right here on WJZ. Kickoff is at 1 o'clock on Sunday. And we get you set up for the action with our purple pregame show. Sports Director Mark Viviano and Quadre Ishmael will be at the stadium Sunday morning at 1130. I love